uh, this video uh, will show you how to find out the Azure database for OE7 software. OE7 software uh, database, uh, Azure database where uh, uh, maybe under two pass. Azure, but I don't know. We don't know which database the Azure database. So we need to find it out. The f how to find out? Actually, easy. The firstly, we have to go to the computer, go to the C drive, go to the under the program files. Sometimes the under the program file eighty six, and then file system, HR management system, and then see here the actually database. This is also database. Other database also enter the other part later. I I I I will show you how to find out. But don't know this one the Azure database or not not Azure uh, not not Azure database. Or we don't know how to check it out. Easy. You need to select the HMS. This one the actually EAC file. This EAC file you select and then right click properties compatibility. You see here. You take here or maybe the you take here, and then this and sometimes run as submit back to like that. You do any one of this, uh, like that you do and then apply. Okay, you are at your database. This one, you are at your database. This one, you right click. I show again. Right click properties compatibility, but you don't take here. You not take here also, like that. This one is not at your database. So we need, like this, we need to find out the Azure database. Now you see, I show you. Okay. Uh, okay. Now properties compatibility. Now we don't take here, so we open the software. See uh, the many percent. Okay, this are the many percent. So like that, you see here. I open the database for you. The password of bank click. Enter. You see here database. Only two percent. Just now the so many percent. So this is the no actual database. So, when you your customer never take here, never take here, so you need to find out the Azure database because the this database not Azure database. So how to find out? Easy. You copy this database file name. You copy. You copy, and then you go to the C drive. And then you find out here. You type the just now the database name, and then they will find. Sometimes I need to wait a few times. A few. Yeah, the stay session. You still need to wait. Thank you. 
no come already. A two database and the AP P data. Uh, my computer got a lot of database. The Azure database under the username. Uh, yeah, this one. The Azure database is like that. The C type, and then the your users, and then you are the computer name, and then ABB DADA data, local purchase to program file, file system HM. Uh, like this one. Uh, this one the computer name. So this one you go to the you go and see the go to the file location. Yeah uh, here file location. Yeah you copy this one. This one the actual data. Now uh, you see I open for you. Find clip. You see employee file. Yeah, just not so many percent like that one. Oh, it came up. Now you can open the software also. Yeah, this one. Just on the one, say one. Just now we open ready. Yeah, that's why this, this is the home to find out the actual database. So the meaning that you are the EAC file is run as admin or window. You take the window ASP subject back to the actual database the same as the EAC file. But that your EAC file is the not take the run as admin or not take window ASP subject back to your Azure database under the C drive, the users, and then this one the computer name, ABBDAT application data, locate virtual store program file, virtual system, Asia management. You need to go there and then, then you need to copy. This is the Azure database.